know you take people lock them up forever on some brute lethal fear campaign bureaucratic mental bricks of rhetoric and blame 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 for the folks off the boat seeking freedom from strikes and human rights why else would they be risking their life all i know is it's outrageous we're courageous sons and daughters crossing waters now living in cages for ages waiting while we conversating arguing debating on what's the real australian or who's just faking or not assimilating more who's on the roof hunger striking to their life aboard while circle goes berserker with their pepper spray politic and politicians wishing it would go away but the issues the same as long as people do manage to escape the weight of a dictator's boot to be processed and held hostage by attitudes we all vote people in less indigenous group many who still treated like refugees on their own land interventions down under and underhand it ain't just here we know it's many places True. plenty worse serving up a racist matrix claiming case would be one of individual basis feeding prison ceo individual pay slips as days rip the gears on the calendar tension builds and builds till christmas becomes a attic so add it up we got enough space here to house a bit more action compassion and less tears before the overseers equating life with the lotto indiscriminate indeterminate incommunicado be the motto of the policy employed but that ain't good enough for our future to be enjoyed how about we take people welcome them like we would want next sequel balance like the equinox the truth is lethal for the ones who want to cage up place behind barbed wire wire up with that same old hate evil seen it for but there i know you take people lock them up forever on some roots lethal fear campaign bureaucratic mental bricks of rhetoric and blame that we all equal really does it manifest with no more people living under mad oppression fenced in denied their request but we get no rest no for us to protest Can't 